Hi, in this tutorial I would like to show you how to use Quick Pages. These are pages that are already designed and they have uh, the holes open for your photos. And these are great in Photo Fusion. Let me just show you here. I'm going to go to Organize. Now this is a kit but it also has some Quick Pages. I'm going to grab them. All you have to do is hold the mouse button down, drag it across. Do you see how it turns everything kind of blue? It incorporates in that blue uh, box. Everything is selected. Simply click on one and drag it up to the bucket and hit Create. I'm going to go down and pick a quick page. Let's pick the red one. Yeah, it's got a red background, so I'll use this. Bring over the red background, right click, image, set as canvas background. And there it is. And then just line up this quick page to fit inside, just like that. You can click right here for an image frame. I like to kind of pre-size it just a little bit. And then just simply right click, position, order, send to the back. Now you just have to drop your photo in and that page is done. You can do your journaling down here. Hit down here for page, add, add an album side. I'm going to add a couple of blank pages like this. Click on the one you want to work with and it will be right here. Let's put a nice blue background, right click image, set canvas background, then go up and we'll pick another page like this one. Already done, looks really neat. Size it down to what you want. Right click, position, order, send to the back takes about three minutes to make a, a whole book like this if you wish. Very, very, very easy. A lot of fun. Kids really like it. Like this. Now this has place for three photos. Let me show you this. We're going to grab a yellow background. Right click image. Set as canvas background. Then I'm going to come up and hit for an image frame. and this one's going to be farther back. So I'm going to set it first. Then we need another one. And it'll be like about here. And then we just need one more. Now you can draw these frames out by holding the F key down. You like this? Now I'm going to click on one, click on the uh, frame here, see how it turns red, and uncheck the border, and then hit the equal sign, they'll all be unchecked, so none of them will have a border. And then I'm going to click on the page, position, order, bring to the front. Now, we're going to zoom in a little bit. And you can see that this, okay, wait, I have to click off of it. And then onto the photo. You see how it picked it up now? And I want to resize this photo so that it's right in the dimensions and you won't see it like in this one or here. See how that did? Just like that. Then this one is going to come up just a little bit and I want to size it up like that and this one if you hold the W key down you can move the canvas when it's zoomed in
there we go just like that I'm going to click this so you can see it now you can come in and just drop the photos and they'll be exactly where they're supposed to be your text down here and there you go now with a lot of my books what I like to do is leave the the page where it says double click here where you would put the text I like to leave that empty when the kids look at the pictures what I like to do is uh, not have text here where this is I like to leave this area blank and then when the kids look at the book for the first time the things that they remember I like to jot down or if they can write have them write it down it means a lot more in their own handwriting when they get older I think they would really like it I hope you enjoyed the tutorial on using quick pages